may also be familiar with him. He's another Ring of Honor uh, talent. Really, really good wrestler. And I actually got the chance to go into the ring after he won the Northeast Wrestling Heavyweight Championship and get a photo. And I was able to get in the ring. And that was one of the best moments of my wrestling fanhood, I guess you could say. And then you got Flip's autograph there. He's like, and he asked me if I want, if he, uh, I wanted personalized. I said, no. And he's like, are you going to sell it online? I said, no. He's like, just kidding. Then we got Chris Jericho. Um, Chris Jericho was a great guy to meet, but his security fucking wanted me out of there in a fucking second. So I couldn't even ask Jericho my only question. And the only question I was going to ask Jericho is how do you balance being a father wrestling for WWE and touring on Fozzie? That's all I was going to ask him. But no, I could not ask him that. So this is right around the time his book came out. So you got uh, his autograph and the go greatest of all time in his own mind. I don't think Chris Jericho's near anywhere near the top, but he definitely is a great, great wrestler. And then I also had um, an extra autograph here that I wanted of the uh, that I, DVD I got. And uh, by the way, if you're going to meet a wrestler, check Ollie's. Because that's where I got this one, this one, or no, not that one. This one, this one, this one, this one. And I got a couple other ones. Ollie's has cheap, brand new DVDs. And I love when they wrestle sign DVDs. They're so fucking cool, man. Next up here, here's another uh, Ollie's one right here. Met Mick Foley, great fucking dude, a great, nice guy, um, hardcore edition, as you can see, it's signed in the gold right there, great dude. Next up, another person, I actually thought this guy might be a dick, but he actually ended up being very nice to me, and that was Bob Orton, God, rest the soul, uh, Hot Rod, Roddy Piper, then you got Bob Orton there, Hall of Fame 2005, great fucking dude. Here's another, here's another one, I kind of wanted to make up for the, um, shitty autograph that he uh, did on this one right here so um i ended up uh getting another marty Janetti autograph and he uh wrote that um this is weird because this is right around the time that he the the news came out of um him being romantically interested in his own daughter which uh that was kind of fucked up uh but i didn't know that when i met him i didn't i read that like a day later and i'm like ooh, that's uh kind of fucked up Here's my Jerry Lawler replacement for the one that got dented right there. So you got the king right there, and it's got a little fucking thing right there. Everything will have a little bit of fucking thing, but that's it's a really beautiful autograph. WWE Hall of Fame 2007 fucking king. Great dude. Next up here, I keep fucking running into this thing right here. Fuck. Godfather, can you please stop being a hard time? Then we got Ricky the Dragon Steamboat right here. Great dude. A little, unfortunately, a little bit of his autograph uh, rubbed off uh, when I... Took it out, but, um, yeah, Ricky Steamboat was a great guy. He actually let me hold a replica Intercontinental Ch Championship, which is really cool. Uh, my Rey Mysterio DVD, uh, which kind of, you know, also smudged off a little bit, unfortunately. Ray was, uh, eh, he wasn't as nice as I thought he was going to be. I mean, I think he likes little kids, but I think Ray's starting to get at the end of his rope in the meet and greets. He, he just kind of was quick with me. He didn't really ask me much. And then we got, um... Brian Anthony, Army, once again. G great guy, three-time champion, 2017. Great dude. Ah, here we go. Corey Graves here. That was quite the experience. Um, So Wrestling Rampage, uh, Joey and Tommy wanted me to tell him that uh, he sucks as a fucking announcer. So that's what I did. And he already wrote the autograph, so I made sure to tell him this after the autograph was written and in my possession, because I didn't want him to be like, fuck you, I'm not going to give you an autograph. And the only re here's the only reason why I got an autograph, Corey Rick Graves. There's only two reasons why. He's a name in the wrestling business and future money that I can get off this. So yeah, I got Corey Graves' autograph. Uh, when I told him that, he's like, why don't you tell your buddies that Wrestling Rampage is what he said, Wrestling Rampage. To come say that to my face, and it was kind of getting uh, a little bit heated. I, I knew it was going to be a, uh, kind of a fight, but uh, yeah. Here's another great, nice dude if you ever meet him, Christian. He asked me, you know, where I lived, how my Thanksgiving was, and I told him, you know, how was your birthday? Because when I met him, it was right around the time of his birthday. He was a great dude. Christian was uh, very underrated. I think Christian was one of the uh, best wrestlers WWE ever had in the uh, 90s and early 2000s. He was a great fucking guy. Next up here. We got uh, Jack Swagger. We got two autographs. Uh, Swagger, Jack Swagger, and then We the People. He's still doing that fucking gimmick. Um, but, uh, yeah. and when, Jack, he just seemed like he was uh, stoned a little bit. He just seemed like he was kind of 
on some pills or whatever. He just like, Ooh, you know, uh, he's like, nice to see you again. And it's the first time I met him. So I'm like, oh yeah, he doesn't have a fucking clue what he's doing. And then we got Cody Rhodes once again. The reason why I keep on getting Cody Rhodes autographs is because he's such a great guy. He's worth the money, man. Uh, I love Cody Rhodes, man. He's a great fucking dude. And I got two of there, him at the Northeast title. What was really cool was I had him, um, you know, for this event, he, he was uh, wearing the Northeast title and I was wearing the Ring of Honor. Or maybe it was the other way around. Uh, he ended up losing the title that night, so it was really cool. Ah, here's my Aaron Carter autograph right here. We got uh, Aaron Carter right there. I know uh, a lot of people are not going to be happy about this, but uh, I don't really give a fuck. I love Aaron Carter, man. He's a great fucking dude. I didn't really get much time with him, but uh, he was a great guy. He asked me my name, stuff like that. Aaron was a nice guy. I, you know, whatever. If you want to hate, you can fucking hate uh, that, that I like Aaron Carter. But uh, he was a nice guy. He was a nice guy. Here's another one you haven't uh, know. I met a uh, singer named Amy Guess uh, at that show. She was opening up for Aaron Carter, so I got Nick. Um, amazing meeting you, Amy Guess. Um, she was a really nice uh, lady, and she was pretty hot, too. <laughs> so I got her autograph there. Ah, the Wrestling Rampage Boys. <laughs> so um, when I won their 1,000th giveaway, I asked them you know, for an autograph and whatever, and they um, already put it in there. So... Uh, Let's read uh, the little note here. Nick Kurtz, congrats on winning the 1,000 subscriber giveaway, which also I won that giveaway with Cole Smith as well. We appreciate that we inspired you to start YouTube. Now, I just want to say something. I know that, you know, they did inspire me to, to do YouTube, but there were other people as well. I just want to get that clear. It wasn't just these guys, but these guys were definitely a big part of me wanting to do wrestling on this channel, so I'll get that out of the way. Thank you for your support of our channel and hope you will continue to support us. Of course I will. Uh, you guys are great fucking guys. Of course I'll always be there. Um, enjoy your prizes you wanted and hope you like the extra stuff as well. Um, thank you, Nick. Your friend's wrestling rampage. One of the best wrestling YouTube channels going today. So there's Tommy right there. Uh, or no, I'm sorry. Thomas, the, the father, pops right in the middle. Then we got Tommy right there. And Joey, so really cool dude, really cool guys, um, yeah, these guys are fucking great, uh, go subscribe to Wrestling Rampage if you haven't already, I know that, um, I say that in almost every video, but, um, they're great fucking guys, uh, then right here, we got, uh, an autograph here from Jeff Hardy, I saw this on Wrestling Superstore, and you guys saw that recently, which that video, um, Part 6 uh, got two dislikes, so I would love to know who fucking disliked the video. Uh, but, you know, you got uh, Jeff Hardy uh, in the autograph right there, and it's authentic. Um, I was able to uh, get a picture. on the. I'm try just trying to do this carefully here. We got a certificate of authenticity. There's Jeff signing uh, the, the picture at WrestleMania 25 with his brother. Uh, great matchup. Great fucking autograph. And then this one right here. Uh... It's the final one, so we got uh, another Jeff Hardy autograph. What The reason why I got this picture was because of this right here. Let me grab it right here. Because of this right here. I got this many years ago at a fair that I, that I go to locally. And I always thought it would be cool if I ever got an autograph to fit into there. Well, I'll figure out how to do it. I've been trying to take that photo out, but it won't come out. I'll figure out a way. But I'm eventually going to put that photo into this right here. So, that is that. And, uh, let me get my power aid. Oh, man. And that is the autograph collection. I'm, I Hopefully I didn't forget anything. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, uh, this is part two that you'll be watching right now. So, I tried to do this quickly. And, um... Yeah, so those are my autographs. Uh, let's count how many autographs I want. I, how many autographs I want. How many autographs I have. So let's see. I may be forgetting one or two, but hopefully not. So we got... And I'm going to count the wrestlers as well. I'm not going to count the photo. I'm going to count just the, the wrestlers and all that. So any autographs from people. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 
17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Um, I'll, I'll count 39 because Jericho, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. So you have 55, 55 to 60 autographs. So uh, yeah, that's pretty good. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. And uh, now the fun part. Uh, cleaning up everything. Oh, that's going to be fucking blasé right there. All right, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Peace out.